here and this is Marxism in a minute. So what is class? The mainstream media is always trying to avoid talking about it at all costs because it exposes the fact that we live in a society where there are conflicting interests. And so if the mainstream media talks about class at all, then we live in a middle class country and basically people are split up based on their income level and patterns of consumption into a country that is mostly middle class and has a few rich people and a few poor people at the ends. Now, in reality, class and wealth are related to each other, but they're not the same thing. So you could be a New York City subway conductor who makes about $70,000 a year, or you could be a bodega owner in uh, the Bronx who makes quite a bit less. But the subway worker has no control over her work shift and the mean, you know, her, the conditions at her workplace, whereas the bodega owner is a small business owner in charge of his own exploitation and likely a few others as well. So in reality, class is about a relationship and your relationship to your job to the fruits of your labor to the means of producing those goods and if you are somebody who has the capital to invest and employ other people and have a say so over their working conditions then you're a capitalist and if you are somebody who has no choice but to work for a wage because you don't have the means to produce your own life necessities then you're a worker and you know the mainstream uh, capitalists might say, well, you have a choice, you can get another job, and often and usually you can't, but even if you could, it's still a job where somebody else controls your working conditions and the fruits of your labor, and that's ultimately what determines your position and social class. If you have any questions or comments, please place them below, and we'll see you next time.